Hi guys, welcome to Epson's Pro. I'm your host Bilal Nasir again with a new tutorial and in today's video I'm going to walk you through how you can add LinkedIn conversion tracking on your Shopify store. So if you're running a campaign in LinkedIn and trying to attract some customers and try to sell your products, you can track your conversion or purchases in your LinkedIn using Google Tag Manager. So if you want to learn, stick to the video. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. It's free and you will learn a lot from this. Without further ado, let's get into the screen. So guys, in order to add conversion tracking for LinkedIn Insight Tag, in order to track the purchases for your Shopify store, what you need to do is first go to create a Tag Manager account by navigating to tagmanager.google.com. And once you go there, you will see a screen like this. So I already have multiple accounts in my Tag Manager account. You won't be seeing anything like that probably so create click on this create account button and create a new account i'm going to name it uh linkedin purchase tracking just that i'm creating a tutorial for you guys on container step i'm going to add the url here so just copy the url paste in the url select web for target platform and then click on create. Once you do that, it will ask to accept the terms and condition, accept that and hit yes. Okay, in a few moments, you will have your Tag Manager account ready. And now it's asking you to install these codes. So just copy this code and go back to your Shopify backend. That's how your Shopify dashboard will look like. And click on online store. And from there, you will see your activated theme. On your activated theme, you will need to add in this code. And to add that code, click on these three small dots and then click on edit code. And from there, you need to navigate your theme.liquid file and in there, add the stop code below head and then the remaining code below body tag so i'm going to search for body and then add in this code below this tag paste the code and hit save okay we have added the google tag manager code to our theme but the Google Tag Manager code will not show up on checkout. So in order to add the Tag Manager code for checkout, exit this and click on these setting gear icon. And from there, click on checkout and scroll down. There you will have an option to add additional scripts to your order status page. You can also call it thank you page. So once someone purchased the product, they are, they are being displayed the thank you message or order status page that what's the status of the order. You can add additional script there by settings and then checkouts. Okay, now copy this code and the other one and add in these codes to your additional scripts. Okay, now hit save. Okay, now we have successfully added the Google Tag Manager account to our Shopify store. Now we will create our LinkedIn Insight Tag. I'm going to go to LinkedIn.com and click on Advertise. And there you will see your LinkedIn Campaign Manager and multiple accounts. If you are on multiple accounts, uh, if you are not, if you only have single account, then you will probably see the campaigns only. I'm on my, I'm on currently multiple accounts. That's why I'm seeing these accounts. Okay, I'm going to go to my default account and then click on analyze and from analyze, you will see conversion tracking. Click on that and create a new conversion tracking action by clicking on this create conversion button and then click on online conversion. And from there, let's name our uh, conversion tracking as Shopify purchase tracking from the conversion behavior drop down menu select 
purchase and then click on next step remaining settings need not to be changed you can add your own currency if you want i leave it as usd for now okay click on next step button and then select the campaigns for which you are adding this conversion action for i'm going to select the first one just to show you guys okay now we have this screen click on user tag manager and here we have our inside tag id okay now shopify uses a specific pattern for thank you url so you just need to select contains here match a url that contains thank underscore url so that's the ending part of the url for the order confirmation page so whoever purchased the products the final url will be ending with thank underscore you which i'm going to show you guys shortly okay now we have our inside tag now we will go to google tag manager and create a new tag click on tags and then click on new let's name it linkedin inside tag or whatever you want to name it you can name it conversion tracking you can name it propify purchases whatever you think is suitable for you to remind okay now click on this icon and here click on discover more tag types in the community template gallery and here we will search for linkedin inside tag click on this search icon and search for linkedin inside tag so that's which we will add that's what is suggested by linkedin in their own documentation okay click on add to workspace and then again click on add okay we have our linkedin inside tag i add it now under partner id inside tag id just copy the inside tag id which we generated by creating a new conversion action click on copy code and then paste it here now where do we want to trigger it we want to trigger it on all pages of our shopify store and then click on save after saving our tag click on submit and publish our tag manager okay we have successfully added our linkedin inside tag using google tag manager to our shopify store now let's go back to our linkedin conversion tracking settings and then hit on create button okay we have successfully created conversion action in our linkedin ad manager account and we have successfully created a google tag manager container and added that code into our shopify store now let's test it out using google tag manager okay click on workspace and then click on preview here i'm going to add in the url of my store and click on connect and here if you look at it you can see that it's showing tag assistant connected and now if we go to our tag assistant window which is this one you can see that it's showing the summary of our tag assistant code so that's our tag assistant code which has been fired when someone opened your shopify store now if i add a test order let's add in a test order for you guys in order to show you guys now add in i'm going to add in a dummy order for this product click on buy it now and just quickly add in the dummy order add in the dummy info and now you can see that our tag manager is not uh, triggering the tag manager code here so if i go back to the screen 
of my tag assistant you can see that it says cannot connect to the website just because shopify does not allow to add code in in the, in the complete checkout process due to the security process it will only trigger when someone go to the thank you page or order confirmation order status page okay now when i click on complete order you can see that our url is ending with thank underscore you which we added in our linkedin conversion tracking settings and now you can see our tag assistant is connected again and if i go back to uh, my tag assistant summary you can see that it shows that our linkedin inside tag is triggered right so we have successfully installed our LinkedIn conversion tracking for our Shopify store. Uh, if you were able to get some help out of this tutorial, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Until next video, have a great day.